Hey all, and what I'm going to do here is pick out some completely random new courses and see if they are any good. Now, I'm expecting a lot of hot garbage here, and this, well, has a lot of W's in, that's all I will say. Let's play the stage anyway and see what this stage is like. It's a speed run and boss battle according to the tags. Right, and here we go. So hit the on-off switch. Take out the piranha plant like so. Take out the bully. Well, here's a boss already. That will defeat itself. And then get the fire flower. And watch all the enemies destroy themselves. Well, actually, that wasn't bad. Considering the horrific title... I'd probably give that about 3 out of 5, maybe 2 out of 5. Not enough for a like, but it wasn't bad. Okay, so here's a completely random pick again. It's called Wyatt by Caden. No sort of picture in the thumbnail to talk about. And no description either. This could be interesting. Let's see what we have here. Anything good or not? So here's the actual stage. Is that the entire stage? Just a row of blocks like that. That sort of alternate. Can't be serious, can you? I've got to sit through this. And make it all the way to the end. Wow. Well, second stage in and... Wow, I think I may need the full timer for this. There's no hidden blocks at the start or anything either, so I've just got to sit through this. Sit through this. Wow. Well, I'm not really sure what to say. I hope this doesn't go on for too long. Let's skip ahead a little bit here. This is going to be really boring. Yeah, it's still going on like this. I can't believe someone actually uploaded this. You can't be serious making a level like this. The maker can't think this is fun. Okay, let's skip ahead a bit more. Yes, you guessed it right. It's still going on like this. Nearly 150 seconds into the level... And it's just blocks alternating. That's it. That's the entire level. This is driving me insane. Right, we're going to skip on a bit further. Okay, I can see what I would assume is the ending. Yes, there we go. There's the flagpole. So, that's the entire level. Nearly 300 seconds of doing absolutely nothing. I can't believe anyone even bothered to upload this. It looks like something I made a while back. Intentional super hot garbage, I called it. We're there, though. We are there. At the end of the blocks. There's the flagpole. Well, I think that has to be a 0 out of 5 level. Maybe even a minus score for that. It's definitely getting a boo. Absolutely 100% boo quality. There we go, let's exit out. Well, this time around I have something called Plus Refreshing Run Plus Sky Hills. So this could be interesting. Those refreshing levels are a bit pointless, but kind of cool in some ways. Let's see what I have here, though. All right, here we go. Short and sweet and art. Right, here we go. Oh my goodness. Power up, spam. I think just run forwards. Well, there's a lot going on here. An awful lot going on here. It's just very spammy, if I'm being honest. Even though it looks quite nice. That was very short as well. Very short and easy stage. Again, it's okay-ish. It's around the 3 out of 5 mark, maybe. I'm going to play it again, though, just because I want to see what's in that pipe. 
yeah, three out of five is probably quite accurate for this. There's no real level to it, and stuff spammed all over the place, even though it looks reasonably nice. You can't even go in that pipe. Oh well, right. I think I'll give this one a like. It's okay, just needs a bit more level to it, so to speak. Right, anyway, let's move on to the next stage. So this one is called Monster Travuk, or something like that. Meant to be Monster Truck, I would have thought. DJ all up in this. Okay. This could be interesting. Not sure what to expect here, if I'm being honest. Oh, a clear condition as well. Right, and what's that massive jump at the start? Where's the truck? Oh, this could be quite difficult. Lots of awkward... That nearly killed me. Right, so go up here. It's a combination between troll and just bad design by the looks of it so far. Couldn't even see that spike block. This first jump is horrible. Where's the truck though? That's what I want to know. You have to get all the coins just to make it a little bit harder. So that was clearly the wrong way. Let's try that again. No, I've managed to hit the spike block. I need to get the coins by the thwomp. Right, let's try this again. I do not like that first jump at all. I don't like this thwomp. I don't like the fact that you couldn't really see what was up here when you hit the trampoline. I don't really like anything about this level if I'm being completely honest. It's just abysmal. But I'm getting there. I can't see where you're supposed to go. Should I just slide down like that? Then... Okay, there's a mushroom in here. Oh, that's brilliant. Another coin here. Yeah, the mushroom just went straight off the level. So where are you supposed to go from here? Again, it's not marked out at all. At least I can go in the warp block here. Right, and that takes me to a P-door. What's up here? That's such a nasty... No, no. This is too bad for me to play. I was expecting some sort of car level, but it's just awful. I would give this maybe 0 0.5 out of 5 at the most. It's not quite a zero level, but it's not far off. How have I ended up on something that looks like this from the thumbnail? You can see all the trash before you even start the level. So you know what this is going to be like. Could this be another zero score? Well, probably. Right, so here's the... Oh my goodness, look at the lag at the start. Look at all the enemies and power-ups. Okay, let's get those stars and try and take out the enemies the best I can. There's a bunch of hidden blocks here as well. I need another star before I die. My goodness, there's a lot going on here. Crikey, someone's literally just put everything right at the start of this level. So there's a random door up there as well. I have no idea... Where that door lead? Ah, another door here. I guess that take... Oh no, there's more to the level, I think. What's going on? I'm being pushed backwards. Okay, this is absolutely ridiculous. Let's try this door. Okay, so that's... Ah, no, that was the one I went in. So let's try the other one. Okay, so that takes you to here. Oh no, I'm going to run out of power up. Okay, I've got a major problem. Be very, very careful. Get the top of that flagpole. Okay. So that's not quite as bad as the previous level. In some ways, that was sort of okay. Maybe 1.5 out of 5? Is that generous? Maybe 1. Yeah, still getting booed anyway. It wasn't good, was it? Let's be honest. Okay, so I will be honest, literally all of the recently uploaded courses look absolutely abysmal. So I'm just going to have to take my pick and hope for the best. And this is what I'm hoping with. Yeah, a bunch of dash blocks in the thumbnail. 
Could this be another spam stage? Well, let's find out. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, this is sort of like a maze, actually. This could be better than I thought. Could be incredibly tedious as well. I would have thought the pink coins are required. Yeah, that's annoying. Annoying more than anything. That's really annoying. Ah, oh, man. That's sort of, yeah. How are you supposed to get in that little gap there? I really hope the pink coins are not required. Okay, so this is an interesting idea, but incredibly, incredibly tedious. Just getting in that gap. How are you supposed to get in? Ah, there we go. There we go. Nice. We're getting there. We're getting there. Okay, there's the fourth coin. Get that coin. Get that coin. Brilliant. Okay. And where's the final coin? I've not seen it yet. Oh, yeah. There we go. Okay, don't fall in that. Don't fall in the gap. Don't. Don't fall in the gap. Seriously, I'm trying to avoid that gap. Ah, oh, no, you can't go in the gap as there's ground there. Oh, come on, get out of there. Okay, there's the door. I didn't... I didn't even need the coins! I'm not going to play that again. Actually, I might, just to find out what was in the door. No, I'm not. No, I'm joking. Getting those coins again would drive me insane. Yeah, that gives an idea of what I think of the stage. One out of five, maybe, if I was being generous. That was really, really annoying. Okay, so after a refresh, I got this. So, maybe decent? Let's give it a go and find out. Thwomp House. Short and sweet and boss battle. Oh, in the dark. Oh! We're well, not off-screen thwomps, but thwomps that kill you immediately if you're not careful. That's not a good way to start a stage. Really not. There's a door up here, though, so... I'm curious as to how to get to the door. Let's go in the pipe anyway. Right, P-switch. Oh, lovely naked pipe there. Are you supposed to follow the... Ah, yes, you are. Okay. In this door here. Oh man, it's got wings. It's got wings. What? How was the timing wrong there? Okay, let's just try again. P switch, go in here, then die on the boss. I could just spin. No, don't spin. That was really stupid. Why did I do that? Okay, so jump on it normally, then spin so you don't die. Wait a sec, you still die on the spikes even if you spin. Right, let's try this again. Oh no, it's flying at the top of the screen. Why is this one enemy giving me so many problems anyway? Am I just playing bad or is it actually hard to defeat? Well, I think you can all answer that for yourselves. That's a lot better. There we go, nice. What? All that's work and there's no key. Oh, you rotten... Why hide it there? Why would you hide the key? Oh, platform dropping at the last second as well. Nearly got me. This is just full of absolutely abysmal design. It's as simple as that. It's literally how not to make a level. There's another key here and a lovely naked pipe. And that takes you to here. Okay. And that's the end of the level. Yeah, that was really bad. Probably another 0.5 level, if I'm being honest. Not quite a zero, but not far off. Definitely deserves a lovely boo. Yeah, I'm booing most of these because they are just rubbish. Well, I'm not really sure what to say about this. Doesn't really look like there's anything there. I'm going to give it a go anyway, though. Just because it appeared after a refresh. Don't know what that says either. And it doesn't have any tags. Alright, so here we go. So, grab the spiny helmet, then jump over the munchers like so. Okay, that's a pretty straightforward start. And then take a hit on the bullet bill launcher. That wasn't very sensible. Oh, there's a boss already, but you get one of these shells. Okay. 
And then I can sort of jump on the boss like this until maybe it falls off the side of the platform. Oh! Okay, that's the second hit. This shouldn't be too difficult. Can you go in the pipe, though? Oh, no, it's caught. Cool. What? It just sort of got stuck on me. Right, so here we go again. Grab that spiny helmet. This time be a bit more careful. Oh, careful. Don't overshoot it. Right, so this sort of boss enemy shouldn't be too difficult to take out. I just need to sort of wait. You can't go in that pipe either. I'm not sure if I wanted to do that, but it didn't take a hit, luckily. A little bit boring, this. You don't really do a lot, do you? It's not an exciting boss battle. I really hope you do have to defeat this for the key, though. There we go, nice. I saw the door. Yeah, there we go, and that's it. Oh no, what? I didn't see there was an empty gap there. So now I have to do all of that again. Are you serious? Was that intentional design? You don't really see that gap. Well, I didn't anyway. It looked like the ground. So yeah, me just walking straight off right at the end of the stage and doing this completely pointless and tedious boss battle again. This is just rubbish, isn't it? It really is. I haven't found anything good so far. I found one okay-ish sort of spam level and that's about it. Oh dear, the new courses are extremely disappointing to say the least. I will actually beat the stage this time around though. There we go, nice. So maybe one out of five. Wasn't really any proper level to it, was there? Let's be honest. It's another stage and I'm going to have to boo just because it's not very good. Just in case anyone thinks I'm intentionally picking out the worst stages I can see. No, I'm not. This is the choice I have after a refresh. And to be honest, none of them look exactly good, do they? Let's pick the one that looks maybe the best out of the three. Maybe the best. Those pipes didn't look good and there's a clear condition as well. All oh, right, so what have we got here? Not a lot. A clear condition. Where's the stage? What's up here? Well, that was a lot of absolute nothing. And there's even more absolute nothing here. Well, do those count towards the clear condition? No, they don't. Right. Where's the buzzy beetles? Where are you supposed to go from here? You can't even see the ground or anything. This is how not to make a level, unfortunately. Can you go in any of the pipes? No, you can't. What are you supposed to do then? Well, that's anyone's guess. I'm going to drop off the end here, I think. Well, there's the next platform, just out of alignment. So, yeah, this was the best looking stage out of the three that it offered me after the refresh, and it's still rubbish. So, I would have thought if I jump over the pipe like this and do a twirly jump, I can cheese it. Look at this. Let's go back in the pipe. Hopefully, there's something. Careful. That's it. Nice bit of skill there. Go back in here and maybe, just maybe, I can do something with all this rubbish. Or not. Ah! Yoshi! Yoshi won't do anything against the buzzy beetles. Really? So... How are you supposed to even defeat them? Do I grab the Mecha Cooper? I guess so. Well, can I grab that without going through the one-way door? No, I can't. And I've left Yoshi behind. 
and miss the clear condition. Oh, come on. You can't even go back. How are you supposed to defeat the enemies? So I think I see how to do it. Just bring a power block with you. Or one of those. But if you don't throw it right, then it's not going to take out all the enemies. Plus, this is really nasty. A sort of drop down to the lower platform when you can't really see it. Let's try the power block anyway. Is this going to work? Yes, it... Oh! Yes, it did. I'm surprised. I really am. Okay, so Red Yoshi is coming... No, you're not. Oh, no, Red Yoshi, come back! Oh, you have to take out this enemy, don't you? There we go. Nice. And in the door... Let's beat this trash, but... Again, that was rubbish. I give that one out of five, just because it showed a little bit of effort. Still getting booed, though, for being rubbish. So this will be the final level I play during this video. If you're looking for something fun and interesting out of the new courses, my advice is don't even bother. I've not found anything that I would consider really good so far. I gave a like to one level just because I felt a bit generous and had to like something. Let's see what this is like though. After I complete this stage, I will end the video. Link's Obby World. What does Obby mean? I have no idea. Anyway, it's another short and sweet level. Here we go go. Okay, so hit that with an arrow. Nice. Then oh, the bomb should go in position. Or not. Oh, this sort of looks like an arrow training course. So maybe alright. What are you supposed to do here? Probably throw a bomb and then hit it with an arrow or something like that. Or just throw a bomb at the last second. Since you get unlimited swords, it's not going to be too much of a problem. Then hit that and... Ah, oh, there we go. Nice. Okay. So this is basically a link training course, I think. Best way of describing this. It doesn't look amazing, but it is actually quite fun. And I'm doing alright so far. What are you supposed to do here, though? Fire an arrow at the cannon? No idea. Oh, I think I see. Oh, what? What? How did I fall off the bottom there? That was slightly embarrassing. Pretend I didn't do that. Even though you all saw me do it. Shouldn't it be too hard to get back to there, though? Right, so... Yeah, I'm describing this as a link training course, I think. Best way of describing it, anyway. This was quite easy, just sort of throw a bomb at the last second. Or not, because my skills absolutely suck. Okay, well, sort of. Can I get through that little gap? Yes, I can. This was easy enough, just fire an arrow and hit that. Then quickly swim up. Then here, over we go. Oh, no, it didn't want to jump. Let's try again, over we go, nice. And now for this part, again, this looked rather difficult, may I add. The door is not in the best of positions. I think something like, not that. Can I avoid going in the door? Okay, how do I do this? I have no idea. Absolutely no idea how to do that. So I think I sort of have an idea of how to do this. It's going to require a rather difficult sort of jump like this. Wow, did I actually manage that? Crikey. Right at the end of the stage as well, the hardest tech to pull off. That wasn't bad. I think I'm going to give that 3.5 out of 5. The level could have done with a bit more in the aesthetics department, for example, but the stage itself was okay. I'm going to give it a like. 
Yes, you actually saw me like a new course. Right, exit out. So there we go. I'm going to end the video at this point. I hope you found that entertaining. In other words, the new courses are pretty bad. You may find the odd decent course there though, so it might be worth having a scroll through to have a look to see what's there. Unfortunately for me though, finding decent courses was kind of tricky. There were a couple though that were okay. If you did enjoy this video, please do give it a like and subscribe to the channel. Subscribing is always very much appreciated. I've included the previous video on the screen. Check that out if you want to do so for some more hot garbage. You can subscribe from here as well if you want to do so. And thanks for watching.